Noob Noob, are you ready to go down on some frosted flakes? They're great! If you like last man. All right. This is it. Noob Noob is oblivious. He does not know anything about what's going on here. He heard rumors that G4 was back, and he's... I world. was excited until I saw this picture of this woman. You're a giant G4 fan, right? I, yep, and I forgot it came back on the air like three months ago. <laughs> so Whoops. Have you been able to catch up with what you've been nope. looking for? No. Nope. It's not on uh, normal cable. you got to pay for it. And you're not about to do not that? Not going to do that without Olivia Munn on it. <laughs> 20 years ago. 20 years ago, Olivia Munn, huh? Yep, she was, she was delicious. So this is new territory for you. This is very new. Okay, and, but you remember all the old hosts. I like, do. Adam Sessler, Morgan Webb, Kevin Pereira, Libby Munn, Allison Hayslip, Candace Bailey. Yeah. Jessica Chobot, Sarah Underwood, mm, all delicious. And you were that was your life's aspiration, right? Uh, yeah, I wanted to apply to be an intern there in San Francisco. <laughs> you were when I was a youngin. San Francisco treat, huh? Wanted to, you know, become a gay free man in San Fran, <laughs> shit on the fl- seats of the uh, right on the ground. Yeah. You don't need to. You don't I need didn't need seats. to pay for rent. I was going to be homeless. <laughs> it. I mean, it works for a lot of people. I there. wanted to get Kevin Pereira's coffee. Maybe, hopefully, he takes me home as his pet. Uh huh. You just I become his dom, you know, we'll transition into that. Okay. I get to, you know, maybe lick Olivia Munn's armpit or something. <laughs> so get weird. Get rural word. Anyway, uh so to give you a little bit of context, for for so f- I guess Frosk is some kind of game reviewer. And I'm, she, we're not gonna play the whole thing. But she <laughs> Has anyone ever there's gotta be you gotta type after we're done this, we need to research Frosk and Machine Gun Kelly because they're <laughs> the same person. Oh, okay. Machine Gun Kelly is a woman that tries to rap, and she transitioned into a burly, ugly man, and that is what we are looking at now as Frost. <laughs> so Frost star- is starting by talking about Red Dead Redemption Online, which is like a dead game, and then transitions into this. Oh, wait, hold on. i got to turn up the volume here. Ready? Sure. My multiplayer experience versus the solo player one, but I actually want to talk about something so much more important than Red Dead Online. Sexism in gaming. Oh. Yup. <laughs> Are you ready for First that? off, what's going on with her teeth? Looks like she got her face kicked in by a donkey <laughs> because probably everyone looked at her and was like, shit, you ugly. Oh my gosh. And joining G4. <laughs> oh, the one woman working there was clapping. Uh, yes. and uh, Black guy Adam- awkwardly clapping because he doesn't want to be like a bigot or something. And there's there's Adam Sessler in the corner. Wait, is he he's on, on a TV? TV? Yes, because he's that. He can't be there for some reason. I don't know why. Is that normal? Don't know. I've never watched this show before. Okay. Just watch this host, though. Watch his reaction. (laughs) This is not where I thought we were going, but I'm here. I have no idea. Does he look like a man who's real excited to go down this this path? (laughs) He's like, shit's about to get real. It's about to get real, man. I'm listening. Yeah. In joining G4, (laughs) I was ecstatic to be part of something that I grew up watching as a child. But every time G4 is brought up in various channels, even in this YouTube channel, we have the chat in front of us. I can see you. (laughs) I can see you. (laughs) They're they're staring at her Uh through the chat. (laughs) Okay. Without a doubt, there will be backlash because I'm not as bangable as the previous (laughs) host. Yep, that's 100% true. <laughs> you are not inaccurate there, my friend. Uh, you, <laughs> wow. I mean, when you make yourself unbangable, that is that like is that your fault when you wear a hoodie I, and not, put a put a nose horn listen, between your nose? Cinderella's dress ain't making that bangable, but still <laughs> I don't necessarily blame her. People are just born ugly. <laughs> and then choose to lean into it by looking like a butch Justin Bieber and going getting going hard on the ugly. Yes. So but that but that doesn't mean she can't be taken as a seriously a serious it, journalist. It means a little for bit. For video games? If, as long as you're off screen, sure. Uh, <laughs> I'd be distracted. She should be, off, she should be off screen talent. <laughs> yeah, I'd, I'd be distracted. Like, if she was talking to me, I'd be distracted by how ugly she was. <laughs> like, what are you saying? Please fix somehow, your face. Talk to him, Frost! It has somehow talk been expected Frost. that you can talk about how much you jerked off to women <laughs> as a compliment. That's it's weird. not a compliment. It's weird. I'm uh, pretty sure it's not weird, bro. You do it in your own house, like, every day. Yep. You absolutely do it. I will 100%. It's dehumanizing and it's weird. 
Women do not exist to be nice on the eyes for you. Morgan Webb, Olivia Munn did not exist to be nice on the eyes for you. They did. Okay, let, let, now we're going to go to some contradictory evidence of this. All right, <laughs> let's, we're going to go to, we're going to refute her claims live on air. So let's just check. This is Olivia Munn from, uh -huh. I don't know when, but uh, yeah. yeah. I, she must have lost a bet. Or everyone else won a bet. <laughs> so yeah, not meant to be sexy on the eyes for us, huh? Oh, am I the towel boy now? It's quite sexy. I mean, it, it's a win, and now she's going to jump into a pie. The oh, like she won't turn around. Is what, what is going on here? Hard drives breaking. Oh my gosh! DVR safe. Is what the world Great. has been waiting for. Is there a reason that it's porno light on me right now? <laughs> yes, there is. Okay, <laughs> so we we get the idea, right? Yep, they're doing it on purpose to make her sexualized. Yes, one hundred percent. So Frost, you've already been proven wrong, but uh, we'll get a little bit more because then we're gonna break down what else is going on. Oh boy! In the in the hidden in the world of this channel, which will uh, <laughs> maybe soon go away. <laughs> Hey, she cooking, y'all. And that's she just cooking. obvious sexism. You don't need to explicitly objectify women or declare that you hate women to be sexist. Just go ahead and check out Thorne's latest melt on Twitter for some spark notes. Oh. Now, here at X-Play, our reviews are written and produced by a team of people. So you don't review your, your own games. Why not? Why don't you review your own games? Uh, Why don't you review games? She's too busy fucking herself up. Oh boy. There are too many games for one person to shoulder the burden. So one person review one game, another person review a different game. <laughs> I see four of you sitting on a couch or three of you and a guy on a TV. So we divide and conquer. And when we use language like we or I, that's the reviewer. That's coming from the mouth. What? what? <laughs> mouth and experience of the reviewer reading that review. And that's not to say that Gerard, TBH, Adam, or myself this guy's don't like, contribute huh? to the reviews. We absolutely do. Uh -huh. But it'll always be in varying degrees and take a whole team behind us. That's why no. we're X play and not Adam play. Okay, so she goes on like a rant about like how annoying it is. Like she'll take extra garbage because she's a woman or something like that. What? Which is just not, like, I don't understand what's going on here. At some point, I'm, I was going to show you Adam Sessler being a seal. <laughs> but I, he's like, er, 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 <laughs> like clapping like an idiot. <laughs> um, Where did she drop the mic? I was going to show her. Oh, here she goes. Saying script is Adam, but you have no problem with he's part of it. You're letting your unconscious biases. Oh, boy. Shit. She said the magic words. Oh, no. She said the magic words. My day, and you're gatekeeping the gaming. Oh, wait, hold on. She said something about this. And you're gatekeeping. Now, hold on. Ready? But you're letting your unconscious biases ruin my day, and you're gatekeeping the gaming space. <laughs> you're ruining my day. Oh, <laughs> it's called don't. Don't read okay. the comments. How many people have told us to drop dead or we're idiots and we're morons? I mean, I don't know how many people have just basis. ran through my girlfriend in the chat. Oh my gosh, that's right. <laughs> Your girlfriend's been tag teamed. I had to buy six several weird sh wheelchairs to make her mobile. Exactly. So maybe for 2022, we'd be a bit nicer, a bit more self-reflective, and we enjoy the fact that people are working hard to make free content for you. If you free? don't like it, don't watch it. Peace. Uh-oh. She also just said the other magic word. Don't like it, don't watch it. If you don't like it, don't watch it. And then we come to this one. Politics. Don't buy my book. Again. <laughs> don't Here we go. Ready? Are you ready for this? And if you don't like my politics, don't buy my book. Problem solved. So that's the infamous Kelly Sue DeConnick talking about her comic books that don't sell. <laughs> And then she, she told uh, people not to buy them. Exactly. And then she came back and I don't have that audio clip, uh, but she came back several years later and was like, I'm really scared about the comic book industry. Yeah. Because you told people to don't buy your book, to not buy your book. And guess what? Dummy. You just did it. If you don't like it, don't watch it. Peace. She's very upset too. Oh, oh there he goes. Is he a seal? <laughs> 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 Okay, so let's move on to what? the bigot in the room. <laughs> and I'm not talking about you. 
Adam We're going to talk a little bit about Adam Sessler The Sessler white now. dragon. Yes. Uh, and look, I don't care if you're a Republican, Democrat, Libertarian. Maybe not. If I'm not a big fan of your socialist, but, you know, everything else is cool. Preferably capitalist, right? Bernie bro. Bernie bros are all, they're all bros to me. So Adam Sessler decided, he, t- he tweets quite a bit. He does. And uh, apparently in some of his fairly recent twits, uh, tweets, because he's a twit, and, and <laughs> read his name. Oh, this, oh, this is this is recent. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Adam, no P for me, Sessler. Just so I can get out of my system once for the day. Republicans are stupid, racist, and drink piss. Okay. How is he still employed? Okay. And then we go. Here we go. Let's see. Uh, keep going. Republicans have a small parabola, the only swing between white nationalism and Nazism. Wow. Okay. So he's accusing people of being Nazis. Okay. Let's keep going. Hot damn Republicans are chicken shits. What? Okay. Somebody likes their politics a little too much. This is all from, this is like all within the last year. Ah, uh, yes. Until they clean their ranks, Republicans are a terrorist organization. They are Nazis with no fashion designer helping them. (laughs) Okay. How is this man employed? Republicans are Nazis. They are a cancer. Fuck them all. What the hell? Yes. Uh... I didn't realize this guy is that maniacal. Oh, he's he's going hard. In a season of peace and reverence for the Sky Demon Republicans, (laughs) and their votes can still go fuck themselves out of existence. Okie dokie. And then uh, here we go, this one. Not for me. As I said yesterday, all the Republicans in my family can eat shit and die while I sip something bubbly. Yes. Okay. So this guy, I think these tweets were actually, some of them were from 2020. I mean, the guy clearly has... uh, He's got some derangement syndrome. He he's a little upset with himself. But he's still doing it even after X plays back, because Comcast sunk a ton of money into it, and I think he's a part owner. So now we're going to go to Geeks and Gamers as they discuss some of the backlash here, and they obviously covered this. And now that you're learning this for the first time, did you see what her name is? What is her Frost? Her real name? No, no. Wait, Indiana Black? That can't be her real name. <laughs> I hate what? to say that. What's your real name? Indiana Black. Froskerin, whatever that means. Frost urine. Froskerin. Froskerin. Okay. Okay. I can't believe she said that she was not as bangable as the previous host. I, I can't even, like, I was going to say, I mean, make yourself more bangable. Preach, but I don't sister. Know. <laughs> preach. <laughs> preach. You don't need to tell me twice. Like, oh, and then Frost, she says she doesn't want Trump supporters as fans. Isn't that like 49 or 48% of the country or something Probably like that? Probably 51%. <laughs> depending you know, on who you talk to. Depending on the true votes. Uh, right, right, right. Uh <laughs> oh look Adam Sessler claps up a dell like a seal <laughs> begging for a kipper. I don't know what's a kipper. This alienates millions of Americans who voted for Donald Trump. Yes it does. Or uh they have 500,000 subscribers, but it seems like they've been losing fans and they were deleting comments during the chat. So oh they're saying it was 75 million Americans. Uh, well whatever. Uh, let's see. So, yeah, the, the D-Day Cobra here captured a whole bunch of messages being redacted, not redacted, deleted. So they're uh, they're taking, th- th- they're like screening everything, and and supposedly uh, they're taking a lot of their like. Oh wait, what they're was censoring the, everything. Oh, does Olivia it say Munn. what the comment was? No, D- nobody knows what they're. Uh, Olivia Munn fire. Oh. Oh, she because fine. yeah, because she hot. She is was. <laughs> she, she's still okay. Uh, yeah. Very welcoming place when people say hi and welcome. And they aren't being deleted. <laughs> <laughs> oh. If you don't like it, don't watch it. So this channel is gonna be. Uh, oh, look at that! I even have, and I didn't read this article ahead of time. That's the old Kelly Sue DeConnick. If you don't like my politics. Don't buy my book. This is clearly going to be a bat women uh, situation where it's going to be on air for at least two or three seasons just because they can't just bite the bullet. Just to, to spite it. 
Yeah. Because they spent, they spent, a, I mean, I don't know how much money Comcast spent on. Probably a good amount. Yeah, but they dumped a ton to refire this thing back up. So are you interested I'm in the new G4? Sad. I'm super sad now because I love G4. And X Play, X Play and Attack of the Show are my two favorite shows on it. Of ever, all and, time. And also Cheat Codes, or Cheat, no, Cheat with Kristen Holt. God, she was hot. She used to be a Dallas Cowboys cheerleader. Don't know any of those people. Um, That's oh. all too young for me. What am I doing? You're too old. You're too old. I'm young enough, mm. but not young enough for Frost. <laughs> so anyway, uh, that's the situation. You learned it in real time the same way that Noob Noob did. And I uh, hope we gave you enough evidence to show you that there's two sides to every story, I guess. You can't just mic drop. First of all, if you think you're just going to mic drop on people, like don't, don't do that. Yep. They're- and it's not good, especially if you don't have like a mic in your hand. And you're not battle she, rapping. She could have mic dropped her bull ring in her nose. <laughs> she should have dropped that. Yeah. Uh, so anyway, if you like what you hear here, uh, make sure that you check out our full length audio podcast, which became, which you can download for free on iTunes, Stitcher, Spotify, all those fantastic places, including our full length live streams on Friday nights at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, where you can hear such annoying things as Noob Noob say this if you don't subscribe. We will go and reach out to Frosk and hire her as our guest host. And you don't want that because she's ugly. And you don't want her on more screens. You want her on less screens. So if you want her on less screens, you subscribe to our show. Yes. And support attractive people Uh that are bangable. (laughs) <laughs> Mainly me, him, not so much. 100% bangable. Yep. <laughs> anyway, that's all for us here at Our Reviews Will Kill You, and uh, we're on to the next one. Wow.